I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stay tuned for a moment of silence. Welcome to this at-home edition of LC Current. Today is Tuesday, February 23rd, 2021. I'm Zingley. Coming up next, your daily announcement. College visits. DePaul University on Monday, March 1st at 11 a.m. Please go to Naviance to register or contact Mr. Taylor in our guidance for any questions. This is just a reminder if you're enrolled as a hybrid student, you're expected to come to class. If you're not able to attend, your parent is expected to call our attendance line to make the proper notification. Make sure that you check your school issued email address as well as your Canvas page for your classes each school day. Attention seniors, this Coolidge scholarship is among America's most generous. A full-ride scholarship that covers tuition, room, board, and expenses for, for four years of an undergraduate study. The Coolidge scholarship can be used at any accredited college or university in the U.S. Deadline is tomorrow at 5 p.m. Please contact Mr. Taylor in the guidance if you have any questions. If you are a freshman, sophomore, or a junior who wants to meet new people, enjoys the spotlight, or needs something fun to do the next year, use your phone camera to follow the QR code on your screen and learn more about the Lawrence Central Speech and Debate Team, coached by Mrs. Watts and Mrs. Majeski. The Performing Arts Department is proud to announce that we plan to produce The Little Mermaid as our musical this year. We will be holding auditions tomorrow from 4 to 6 p.m. Any student that is at LC or taking classes here may audition. Please prepare a song from a Broadway or Disney musical. You do not have to be in a performing arts class to audition. Additional information or questions, contact Ms. Horrigan or Mr. Ellis. There will be a fascia workshop this Saturday at 11 a.m. through 12 p.m. On Zoom, contact Mr. Taylor in the guidance to request the link to register. Attention all gamers, we mean all gamers, not just video gamers. If you like video games, board games, tabletop games, and or TCGs, consider joining the LC Game Club. See Mrs. Damron in room 181 to fill out an interest form, or you can find our page in the LC Club Hub on Canvas. The LC Game Club is considering providing D&D sessions for those curious and new to D&D, or experienced players looking for a group to campaign with. Contact Mrs. Dimron and fill out an interest form. Congratulations goes out to the following freshman Eden Ridout in the original Overtory event for placing in our first speech meet, our swimming and diving team yesterday during their sectional competition. Deshaun Fuqua placed fourth place in the diving competition and advanced to regionals. Dominic Daggy for placing second in the 500 freestyle and third in the 200 IAM. And our men's basketball team on the big win over Avon. Today's vocabulary word is retarget, a verb meaning to direct something towards a different target. Did you know that all dog owners remember that February 23rd is National Dog Biscuit Day? This day is observed around the world as an International Dog Biscuit Appreciation Day. Dog biscuits come in varieties of sizes, shapes, and flavors. They serve to reward a man's best friend for good behavior as part of their training. Dog owners may also give a dog biscuit to show their canine companions just how much they love them too. Sometimes dog biscuits serve to deliver vitamins and medicines we often may have difficulty getting our pooches to take otherwise. 
Specialty treats offer dogs and their owners so much to choose from. Even dogs on restricted diets won't have trouble finding a dog biscuit that is gentle on their tummy. Others help keep their teeth healthy and fresh too. What better reward could you ask for? Celebrity birthdays, Dakota Fanning is 27, Aziz, Aziz Ansari is 38, Emmeline Blunt is 38, and Josh Gatt is 40. This has been today's Current. Stay warm, Elsie!